Hello once again and welcome back to thedrinker.co.uk. I'm Pete Turner and in this little series of films we're looking at wines that are on the high street in the UK in the summer going into the autumn of 2021. In this film we're looking at the wines that are available that I've picked from Morrison's. Uh, Morrison's one of the great hidden gems of supermarket wine. Um, really good team, they really know what they're doing and there's some really great prices and, and, and wines, particularly in their The Best range. We've got a few of, uh, from The Best range that they do. Um, I've got two reds, two whites, a rosé and a fizz. They're all priced under £10 and these could be your summer house wines this year, 2021. So we're going to start off with Beaujolais. This is Beaujolais Raoul Clarget. It comes in at five pounds a bottle. Five pounds a bottle. They also do a flurry, which is excellent if you if you want to get that. It's a lot more expensive, about nine quid a bottle, I think. But this is uh, Beaujolais Raoul Clarget, five pounds. It's quite dark for a Beaujolais. And I think Beaujolais is one of those great wines. I chill this. And, and I know you say don't chill red wine, but Chilled Beaujolais is one of the perfect things of a summer's day. Um, and I think it just helps bring the fruit out a little bit more. They're lighter bodied wines anyway, so so they, and they, oh, it smells of strawberries. Um, it brings out that beautiful sort of strawberry, fruity character. And I think Beaujolais is that, um, it's the red wine for people who think they don't like red wine. So let's have a go. So already notes real forward strawberry on the nose. Yeah, and that strawberry is joined by some sort of red currant. And there's a little tiny bit of tannin, but not very much, as you would expect for Beaujolais. Um, at five pounds a bottle for a, a lovely chilled uh, red patio wine, uh, I think that's, a, that's an absolute bargain. Okay, so next up, probably a bit of a contrast is, this is from their The Best range. This is the best uh, Merlot, Chilean Merlot. And this comes in at 7.75 a bottle. And already on the nose, it's a whole different ballgame from the Beaujolais. Um, it's sort of a red, a black currant. It's uh, black currant, black currant leaf. There's a little bit of sort of tyre rubber there, some tariness to it, but in a really lovely way. It's quite quite a lot of oak to it, but not in a bad way. So, so there's some sort of vanilla and coconut uh, character to it. And yeah, that carries on on the palate. I'm surprised um, the tannins aren't as big as all that, but they're there. There's a really good structure. It's a really well-made wine. And at 7 75 a bottle, I think that's, um, that's a classy, classy wine. It's, there is some oak. People who don't like oak probably aren't going to like this, but I don't think the oak dominates the big fruit and the lovely supporting tannins. A really, really complex, really interesting wine at 7 75 Okay, so next up. We are again with the best. This is the best Alberillo. It's from Spain. It's at 8.25 a bottle. Um, look, good looking sort of patio wine this. Yeah, it's got a lovely sort of basic uh, lemon scent to, to the nose. Yeah, and that carries on on the palate. It's really refreshing. It's zippy and and lively and uh, yeah really refreshing acidity to it but in a really good way yeah lovely lemon character there is a little um dollop of other citrus in there maybe some sort of uh, what's that satsuma something like that in there it's a beautiful wine at 825 really interesting refreshing wine for a hot day sitting under a tree lovely wine okay so next up again the best this is eight pounds a bottle. It's their Gavi, 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 Gavi. I say Gavi. There you go, eight pounds. Whole different ball game. Yeah, from the Alberino. It's got some almond and some peach blossom uh, on the nose. Yeah, it's, it's fuller in the body. It's much bigger in the body. It's more expressive. Um, it's more rounded. It's um, th There's acidity there, but it's not as flashy as the Alberino. Um, yeah, lovely wine. It's um, peach and pear. There's some hint of apple in there. Um, and, and the body is really, it really works. For eight pounds a bottle, classy, classy wine. Like it. Okay, so next up, a rosé. There is only one place on earth where this rosé in a bottle like this can come from, and it's from Provence in France, and it's called Le Provençal. Uh, it's a beautiful colour. Um, it's eight pounds again. 
And on the nose, it's got a really lovely crushed raspberry uh, note to it. Yeah, and there's red currant and raspberry on the on the palate. It's a beautiful wine. It's fresh. It's dry. It's pretty. It's in a lovely bottle. It's kind of everything you want rosé to be at eight pounds a bottle. Super stuff. And then we have got. We're going to finish on Prosecco. Co. 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 Prosecco. Seven pounds a bottle. Uh, Prosecco doesn't seem to be getting any less fashionable. There's a lot of it about. There's a lot of really quite average Prosecco about. But seven pounds a bottle. Let's have a little snifter of this. It's lovely and pale. Uh, this has been poured for some time, but you can still see there's a lovely mousse to it. There's lovely, lovely bubbles still persisting. And it's peach and 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 it's light and it's um, sherbet uh, also. What a lovely wine. For £7 a bottle, you could do a lot, lot worse. Um, lovely Prosecco. So there you go. Six wines uh, from Morrison's. I'd get yourself down there. You can probably hear that's uh, my helicopter just arriving. Uh, get yourself down to Morrison's, enjoy their summer wines. Give us a like, give us a follow. Uh, we're at Drinker Site on Twitter. Uh, tell us what you're drinking this summertime. And here's to very, very good summer drinking. Cheers now. <laughs>